And the crazy concept that we had was we need to buy somebody a gift. But this Christmas, I'm accepting a gift. And then I will become the gift. Woo, glory. Tap your neighbor. Tell him today, I'm accepting the gift to become a gift. Once your mindset changes and you get this gift, there's no way you can sit on something that's so good. When you get a new car, you posted the picture on Facebook. <laughs> you wash it, you keep it clean, you go to get a little air freshener, you check the tires, you keep the gas, you keep the oil checked. But in 10 years, that car will be 10 years old. But this gift is the gift that keeps on giving. If you'll simply read your word, pray every day, if you'll simply fast when God tells you to fast, be obedient to the Holy Spirit, you will not suffer lack. And see, you gotta walk that thing out. Let me show you what I mean. Now, you're gonna stall over here like a baby, and that baby's on the ground crawling and crawling and crawling, but he's crawling on all fours. And, and then sometimes, you know, he can get to where he can stand up just a little bit, but he may fall back down, and, and then he can prop up on something and stand there and weevil and wobble, and all of a sudden he just sat down again. Oh my goodness. But the baby don't stay down when he falls, he just keeps getting up. Don't y'all understand? This is a gift in which you are growing as a Christian, you're growing. See, you might fall down, but you better get back up again. Don't you stay down. You were not made to lay there. You were made to get up in Christ Jesus. And so we keep moving forward. And now the baby on his tippy toes and he walking just a little bit. But I see him now walking. And then after he begins to walk, he tries to run. And he may run a little bit and fall. Oh my goodness. But he don't allow a little bit of setback to mess him up. What he do is he get back up again. And he keep running. And he might fall again just a little bit. But see, he's growing in God. Don't you understand what I'm saying? In the midst of you being a gift, you will fall sometimes. But we don't lay down and wallow in it. We right. get back up again. Yes. Somebody's watching you. They saw you done fail five times. But they saw every time you fail, you got back up and you gave God the glory. Yeah. And after a while, his run becomes better. Yeah. He's running now. And he can run about a good hundred yards and he won't fall. Right. Glory. But if he runs 200, he stops for a minute and he catches his breath. But the more he keeps running, the stronger he gets. What are you saying, Apostle? I'm telling you, don't stop walking. Walk and fall down, get up again. Well, don't stop running. If you, if you run and fall, get back up again. Because you're a gift to somebody. Somebody been watching you who don't even come to church. Be the gift for somebody in 2015 all the way over into 2016. They don't come to the house of God because they see the glory on you. They don't come because they see the gift in you. Yeah. That natural ability, human, that supernatural ability that transcends everything that the, it is an anomaly. Don't y'all understand that the whole birth of Jesus, y'all could be seated, was an anomaly. Mm -hmm. That not an anomaly is something that happens outside of the norm or the usual. And since Jesus was born, I ain't never heard of any type of virgin birth since. And that anomaly is a flip that don't fit into the physical laws of nature. But whatever we want to class it, then we have to deem it in as supernatural. See, we serve a supernatural God who has not stopped doing the supernatural. Amen. Tell your neighbor and say, I know with you, it's impossible. But with God, it's possible. Amen. 